right then. I guess nobody's here yet. Oh well. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna survive this. Hello, James. Every opponent has a predictable pattern. Learn that pattern and you won't suffer so much as a scratch. Does everything sound fine? Yeah. How do I attack? And hello, small deer. I should have been paying attention. Alright, that'll work. That green guy didn't move at all. And this blue one just moves up and then down. So if I attack him from the side, I'll never get hurt. Okay. Easy enough. All right. A broadsword, not as sharp as I'm used to, but I bet it can still take out three enemies in one shot. How do I attack, though? Oh, crap. Oh, I guess I just move into them. Okay, this makes sense. Looks like those skeletons put their hands in the air when they're about to jump. If I'm in the way when they move, then it's gonna hurt. Okay, I might be silent for a lot of this because it takes a surprising amount of concentration to do this. Like, play a rhythm game and talk. But I think I get the hang of it. That was a pretty easy tutorial. So, uh, for those of you not aware with Crypt of the Necro Dancer, it's a rhythm game roguelike weird combination, but I'm going to try my best to play some of it for an hour. It's my first time ever playing it. Oh, crap. So, as you can see, I'm doing amazing. Oh wow, I actually have enough money for these, so yeah, I could use some help. Uh, well, yeah, let me just go ahead and use that, and might as well. Okay, so I think I have a rhythm going now to open this door right here. Done. Here. Crap. Alright. Ah. So that was amazing. Oh, wait, I didn't get hurt. Okay. It's going to be a little rough starting off, but I think I'm slowly getting the hang of this. I'm just gonna be way more patient than I need to. Okay. Well, somebody needs help. I did it. Okay, see you in the lobby. I don't know what that means. Okay. Enemies, I am ready. Or not. Okay. All right, all right. That was a good first attempt, I guess. Yeah. Dance pad mode. Hmm. I'll look into that for later on. 
Oh, fast moving in the lobby. I guess this means I don't need to go on a rhythm. That makes things a lot easier here. But all right. I am... What can I spend them on, though? Hmm. I don't see a shop. Oh, he'll train me to fight enemies. Isn't that nice? But I think I got the hang of it. Oh, here's where I spend the diamonds. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need the defense. I'm a coward like that. Then what do we have up here? The dungeon master. I probably should have saved my diamonds for him. That's why you don't spend them on the very first thing you see. Uh, and then we have this. Master advanced techniques. I'll be fine. Famous last words. Okay, let's go back to zone one. Oh, wait. You have character select two, but I don't have anybody unlocked yet. All right, fair enough. Yeah, I have no choice. I know certain characters make this game really difficult. But right now, I just need to get accustomed to normal gameplay. Also, this music is amazing. Okay, so there are monkeys here. Okay. And of course, I dropped the beat. Whatever. Hmm. Well, what do we have here? No, seriously, what do we have here? Ooh, I will gladly accept that. What have I done? Okay. This is frightening. And that was a one-use thing, so now I'm kind of screwed. Okay, well then. That could have gone a lot better. <laughs> it's a roguelike. It's a roguelike. It's going to start off pretty difficult at first until you get a hang of things. It might take me a lot longer than some, though. Okay. So how's everybody's day going? Who's excited for Thanksgiving? I'm not. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take that. The only reason I'm not excited is because I'm gonna have to go over to a family member's house to eat and I would rather just stay home. apple pie oh yeah I think the family also did task me with making some banana pudding banana pudding is good though and so I don't really mind being tasked with that it's easy to mess it up if you don't know what you're doing some people just don't know what they're doing I guess I can't break this fair enough Oh my god, that tipple change kind of screwed me over. Wow, I should have paid attention to how much damage he was doing. Hi, Sapphire. You haven't missed much, just me failing at learning how to play this game. Oh, wait, I got diamonds, that's right. Uh. Hmm. 
permanent upgrade. Yeah, I'll take a heart container. Why not? I kind of need that right now. All right, time to focus. Yeah. Okay, that was a bad idea. Nice to know that enemies can use those too. Crap. And... Ugh. The reviewer having issues playing Spyro, taking hours to beat Buzz. I think I saw that. Like, how do you compare Spyro to Dark Souls, though? It's not that hard of a game. <laughs> well, that happened. Somebody did. Uh, okay. Well, in true roguelike fashion, before I go to the next floor, I gotta explore. Is this a trap room? This looks kind of scary. Well, that's what I get for exploring. So I guess I have no choice but to explore this floor now. This music, though. Crash was hard due to new physics. When you get used to it, the difficulty goes away. Well, yeah, for the most part, but I mean, like Slippery Climb, Stormy Ascent, Future Tense, those are still pretty tough stages, all things considered. All right. Okay, I like this broadsword. It's essentially easy mode. And I need a gold key to rescue him. Don't worry, I got you. Okay. I really need to learn how to deal with these enemies. That was a boss. Well, he was easy, monkey, okay. So far, so good. Aside from the fact that I am near death. I need to find a gold key to help that dude out. I gotta save him. Wait, that looks like a cracked wall. It worked. Ooh. Stand still and keep your multiplier, huh? All right, well, first off, I'm definitely taking that. Uh, screw it, I'll take them all. Why not? Am I enjoying Let's Go? I actually haven't started it yet. Because... I guess I need to go back and get my other weapon. That was very bad. But yeah, I haven't started it yet because I kind of need a new left Joy-Con. Oh, your time per stage. Well then. But yeah, I need a new left Joy-Con or I just need to send mine in to get fixed. And I've... I've kind of been postponing that. But from what I've seen, it looks really fun. Hello. Okay, these items will show up in chests. Now, what do we have on the permanent unlocks? 
Why not? Oh, I don't have enough. Yeah, why not? Sorry about that. Thank you for saying that about the cursor. Alright. I really should figure out how to disable it showing up in OBS. Disabled by default in uh, Bandicam, but not OBS for some reason. Ugh. Okay. So far, so good. Well, hello there. It's a monster house. Ugh. I am very good at rhythm and not taking damage from enemies. So how many floors in a zone to the, I ask to the people that are familiar with Crypt of the Necro Dancer. Okay, do I want more damage or do I want wide damage? I'll take more damage. Because I am a noob. Yeah, I'll take more storage space. I don't want that. I'll stick with my big sword. And yep, this game, it is called Crypt of the Necro Dancer. It has a great soundtrack. It's my first time ever playing it. That's why I'm a little bit rough around the edges. But that's kind of what happens your first time through a roguelike. All right. Uh, it is interesting that everything is rhythm based though. It just requires like an extra layer of concentration. Ah. So I'm about to die again. That's pretty great. And I am very afraid of this boss. At, you can clearly see why. Okay, then. <laughs> I'm going to beat this zone. <laughs> Hi. Screw it, one red chest per run, why not? Anything in here I can get for one? Yeah, cheese is good to find in chests. Okay. This is, this is gonna be the one. I say as I take stupid damage. Okay, then, never mind. Uh, I don't want that torch. Okay, I should actually, like, take a few seconds to see how the enemies are gonna move in a given room. <laughs> Binge the new She-Ra show. Kind of want more. Yet soundtrack sounds very good. Also, I'm very bad at rhythm games since I don't have the rhythm. All you gotta do is believe in yourself. Uh, ooh, what is this? Oh wait, this backfired on me. Oh, this is like a devil deal from Binding of Isaac. Yeah, I am not about to sacrifice health for this. I heard mixed things about the She-Ra show. Like. I know one person that thought it was pretty okay. I know another person that didn't like it. And then one person who hated the first few episodes, but then halfway through was like, oh, it gets good. Oh God, I'm dead. Why 
why not? If I got the gems, I might as well spend them. You never heard of She-Ra? It's, like, it's just a remake of a old 80s cartoon that was only made to sell toys to little girls. I'm not joking, either. <laughs> That's kind of what a lot of, like, 80s cartoons were. Just there to sell toys to kids. Only some shows actually turned out better than others. Ooh. Okay, I need to find some coins to buy that map. Things are going pretty swell right now, though. I'm just consistently losing the rhythm because I'm trying to do way too much at once. Okay. So when things go bad in this game, they go really bad. I will wait for you. Smartest decision I ever had. Yeah, I get the feeling that's why a lot of people are upset with She-Ra. Like, they're just scared of new things. And then all these people are like, oh, it's not like the cartoon I remember from when I was a kid. Like, half these people probably never even watched that show when it was originally on or were even old enough for it. Like, old enough, or the, like, the right age where they were you know, alive during the time the show was on the air. And now. It'd be like me complaining about the Jeffersons or something. Uh, let me go ahead and eat that cheese. I'm on to you. There we go. Oh, those things are like booze. Oh God. Wow, when you actually pay attention to enemy movement patterns, this game is actually doable. He needs a gold key. Don't worry, I got your back fam. Oh no. Oh my god! Why can't I... Why can't I beat the Minotaur? I hate this. Latest trial of Phoenix Wright has to be your least favorite. It's... It, it is a thing. It is a thing. Um... No, it is not almost over. I say that because I've kind of recorded quite a bit. But from what I've heard, general consensus, this trial actually is one of the least favorites like in the series. I mean, I'm gonna get into my issues with it later on, but yeah, it is, uh, it is rough. How do I deal with him? No, I just want to learn how to deal with the Minotaur now. Like, I I don't understand his pattern. I was trying to bait him out there, but it wasn't really working. Oh, I just become glass. No, thank you. Yeah, a lot of old 80s cartoons did not age well at all. Some did, but the vast majority didn't. But at the convention I was at not too long ago, there was a panel that was talking about, like, random cartoons you never heard of. And, like, a lot of the ones they showed were 
cartoons that were made just to sell toys. I'm trying to remember the name of one that was like just really insane. Oh my god. I, the name escapes me. It was Dino something. Dino Saucer, I think. It was like dinosaurs and aliens. I, I don't know. It was... The 80s were a weird time. <laughs> yeah, I would gladly take that compass. I would gladly take that. Alright. Yeah, I don't think I need anything else on this floor. I'm out. That baseline, though. Okay. I just can't keep a multiplier to save my life. Ooh, that looks good. Oh, that only <laughs> went to the sides, but at least I dealt with the dragon all oh, year. Could it be I'm actually getting the hang of this? Do I explore? Yeah, I'll explore this floor some more. I'm actually doing well. I know, I'm stunned too. Oh god. Alright. Will there be a gold key here? No, there won't. Eh. Eh, why not? Ooh. So I now have two horizontal fire blasts, essentially. Well, one is a one-use item and the other is a spell, so... Alrighty. Just trying to see if I can help out that dude. Hmm. Do I want cheese? Well, I've actually been doing a decent job this time around not getting hurt. I think I will leave that health behind. I will probably regret this decision later on. Ooh. A random item for 40 coins. Why not? What did I just buy? Oh, that's good. Well, I was gonna go to the next floor anyway. All right, that is definitely a gold key. And of course that money fell down a pit. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm slowly getting the hang of things. I'm mad that I actually have to think about am I pressing left or right, though, when I'm using an item. Hmm. Cheaper shops would be fine. Okay, I'm never going to go to one of those again. God dang it. And I was doing so well. Okay, this time, I'm serious. We're going to beat zone one. Yeah, 
I'll stick with my dagger right now. Decision. Okay. <laughs> quick restart. No, quick restart. I don't deserve to spend diamonds after that showing. I'm shocked they don't have a pity character that you unlock for just playing awfully. kind of need like a no tempo character now. I'm not doing so amazing. But you were good at rhythm games. You might hear some snark in the background. Okay. Gonna do that bomb right there. Okay, but that's the deal with the devil. Yeah, no. Feeling confident about this one now. I have a healing item. And this bat is like super easy. See? Only took damage off that skeleton. That's all. I left a gem on that floor. Oh well. Okay. So far so good. This broadsword is so cheap. Hmm. I like that item. Anyone heard about the one day where both Apple and Google took down the Tumblr app and everyone on Tumblr thought Tumblr was going to die? I didn't hear about that, but people always think Tumblr's going to die for some reason or another. So, so Yeah, but I thought, like, the porn bot thing was, like, what sort of happened with the NSFW blogs, like, recently. Right, right, right. They were like, it, because of, like, that was related to the blog, I think, now. So, back on the app store. Oh, but there was also the fact that they took those blogs down by accident too because they were just trying to get rid of the blatant like spam blogs and the only reason like the NSFW blogs were hit by that was because not ah, crap like a lot of them like all they do is just post pictures and links and stuff because there was even like some YouTubers that got their blogs taken down too because all they do is just post links to YouTube, which is a non-Tumblr site. But yeah, Tumblr has a lot of issues. <laughs> you can say that again. Which is why now a lot of artists are just moving back to Newgrounds and Twitter. Newgrounds. Newgrounds is they, they turned they turn things around like quite a bit. Like they're they're good. Well, they're also like source for flash archiving and yeah okay, by the way your viewers can't hear me i think they can i don't think like whatever i'm just like, uh, 
Oh my god. Yeah, in case you couldn't hear him. Uh, Ar oh my god, in the... Um, yeah, I need to heal. Uh, Arbor is in the background. You might hear him, you might not. The Blue Yeti is a good mic, but I don't know if it can pick him up. Uh, he's here to provide snark and just the occasional conversation. He also lives here, you know, there's that too. Uh, okay. Health, please. I, I need this. Yeah, I need that too. I will come back for you, Gold Key. Oh, wait, no, I don't have enough just yet. He's currently playing Puyo Puyo Tetris. You might hear his sounds of anguish occasionally. Fun fact, I am better than him in Puyo Puyo Tetris. Save somebody. Hell yeah. She will see me in the lobby. See, that, that's a win right there. Yes. Okay, I do not like those black skulls. Yeah, I might need this. Kill to heal. Kill to heal. Oh god, that was frightening. Why were there so many enemies? Dang it. I have 17 minutes to make this work. It's not like Sound Dodger is going to be any better because I haven't played that in a hot minute. But as you will see with some of the songs on there, you know, I, I got perfects on them. So I knew what I was doing back then. Yeah, I will gladly accept a longer range. Oh, this is really good. And Apple. Okay, yeah, I like the spear. I take back everything bad I said about you, spear. And it's good for dealing with the Minotaur. Hell yeah. We in there. Oh god. Okay, those monkeys are pretty deadly because they stopped their movement. I finally know how they work. <laughs> It only took 45 minutes. I think these ghosts are like booze. Yep. Okay. Give him doing it in the house since I live with him and I have fallen out. Oh. Ew. Yeah, they are kind of like re-deads. 
I guess. Oh, we got no, no. Uh, the the, the monkeys—they're they're small deer compared to the redeads, and yeah, I can kind of see that. With the whole them grabbing you and trying to bite your face and or hump you to death. Ugh. Yeah, I noticed a lot of people have fallen out with family recently. Man, but at the end of the day, you know, family is just people you live with for some of your life. They can turn out to be bad people too. Ugh. I hope you still have a good Thanksgiving, though. Like I said, I probably won't enjoy mine because I have to go over to my cousin's place. My cousin's cool, I just don't want to leave the house. I'm a hermit. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, screw it, I'll take this too. I just want to stay home and play Xenoblade and Pokemon. Oh wait, no, I I, I can't play Pokemon yet. I need the freaking Joy-Con. <laughs> Damn it! I should just go ahead and send it in the Nintendo to fix. It's only going to be thirty dollars. But I'm also thinking like I can just buy one, <laughs> a new controller. I mean. Okay, I killed everything in this room with surprising skill. Now to just waste it all. Okay, things are going a little too well right now. I did not mean to drop that bomb. That's what I get for fat fingering. Music though. Oh god, okay. Oh no. It's a different color Minotaur. Okay, I am deathly afraid of him. Eh, I wasn't afraid. That that was the easiest thing in the world. Oh god, are you quoting lose yourself to me in my chat? I would keep the reference going, but I have kind of forgotten a lot of the lyrics to that because of Mom Spaghetti. <laughs> it has forever ruined that song for me. Okay. Next floor. Death metal. Wait, is this a boss? Like, I mean, an actual boss? Oh God. Okay. I am afraid. He seems easy enough. Oh, he teleports. Oh my god, I did it. And yeah, this song is really good. I kind of don't want to go to the next floor. But I must. I must. Dad was always coming and going on his adventures. Oh my god, story? But this time he seemed more excited. He said he'd found it, some great treasure. When I was older, I found the notes he left behind. Directions to a graveyard. 
Uncle Eli tried to stop me. But Dad had been gone for two years. I had to find him. This really is reverse binding of Isaac. Only instead of trying to kill your mom, you're trying to find your father. Makes sense. Alright. New character unlocked. I've unlocked Eli. So how's he any different? I'm just curious. Will it tell me? Oh, I have to actually like step on infinite bombs and I can kick him at enemies, so he's Bomberman. I like I like the sound of that. I really do. But I'll stick with her. Oh, I have Bard unlocked too. Yeah, he's the easy mode one. <laughs> enemies move after you and you don't need to stick to the beats. Yeah, I ain't no punk. All right then, so. Yeah, we'll stick with Cadence for now. No, wait, stay. How do I get back to the shop? Oh, I actually have to like select continue. That is weird. Hey. Unless you train against bosses. I am definitely gonna keep you in mind. Okay. Find you in zone one. Yeah, I didn't have the key for you then. Hello. Hmm. Hey. Why not? And why not? All right then. Let's see what Zone 2 is all about. Oh, I need to get used to the fact I don't have my spear anymore. Yeah, they have an AOE. Okay, fair enough. Oh, that... Wow. Okay. This place is pretty scary. Oh my god, the AOE. It seems very doable, though. Can I break these? Okay, I am never going to touch those again. Are you a mimic? I guess so. I killed whatever you were before you could even do anything. Oh god, thank you. Wait, no. Cheese, use it, grab this, okay. More storage, yes. Careful around those mushrooms. Okay, so. Oh, wow, that is a neat effect. I'm not even mad about that death. A death in status effect in a rhythm game. That is amazing. <laughs> I think I got a little time to give it one more shot. Oh, wait, wait. How many diamonds do I even have? I don't even think that's enough to buy anything. Wait, no, I can buy a whip. That's right. Okay. Let's give it another shot. This chill music, though. Yeah, it's just better to wait for him to jump and then hit him. Okay, fair enough. Yep. The 
vision radius thing isn't really coming into play, in my opinion. It's not like it's too hard to really see where you're going. enough for something cheap at this shop. Yes, please. Okay, all right. I'm getting the hang of things. Crap. Need to pay attention to when the skeletons are raising their arms. Oh, I'm getting the hang of things. Immediately take stupid damage. Oh my god. Alright, one more quick attempt. Uh, yeah, I don't have enough. And you're just there for training. Did I go down here to the janitor? Remove items from the item pool. I guess that can come in handy. I've never actually seen something like this in a roguelike where you can actually pay to have stuff removed from the item pools. That's interesting. I mean, yeah, I, I get why you would want to remove weaker items so, you know, you have a better chance of finding stronger items, but... Huh. I'll keep that in mind. Like, I still think there's, like, more positives than negatives to have a bigger item pool, even if weaker things are in the item pool. Because you never know when you might just need, like, even just that small little bit of help. God, armadillo, why? Thought I could trust you. Yeah, you never know when an emergency is going to arise. Oh my god. Okay. Then again, I say that, like, I know how this game's item thing works. Ah, crap. Oh my god, just... Yeah, this run is not about to happen. I will wait for you, golem. Million IQ. Where's that Minotaur going? Okay, so that was god awful. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and stop for now. I don't even have diamonds to spend, so. Yeah, that was Crypt of the Necro Dancer. My first time playing. I enjoy it. It's pretty cool. It's just kind of rough for me, but I'm slowly getting the hang of things. So, yeah, I'm going to take a little break, five minutes or so, and uh, after that we'll start up Sound Dodger.
Okay, everybody, just give me a second for some reason. It, OBS isn't recognizing Sound Dodger. I'm going to have to do a little workaround for this. Okay. So do that and then no. Um Huh. Why is it not visible? Just making sure all that you guys can see on stream is a black screen right now, right? Yeah, okay then. Um, one moment. <laughs> is going on with this. Okay, I'm going to take the stream down for a second and then restart it. Hopefully this will not screw things up. Famous last words. Okay, this is not help. Like, what, what the fuck is going on here? I don't even get this though. It's not even showing up as something that the window can even capture. Like, okay, now it shows up. Now it's there in the preview. Okay, I don't know what I did, but now it's fine. Okay, and by some miracle, the game is now visible. So, yeah, Sound Dodger. For those of you who are not familiar with this, 
Also, can people hear me? Chat, can can you hear me? I am seeing like no. Oh, okay. Thank you. I was I was about to be afraid. But yeah, Sound Dodger. It's kind of weird to describe this game. It's but like a better term, an omnidirectional rhythm based bullet hell game. You'll see what I mean after seeing like one level, but ew, I have to turn this down a bit for my headphones. Oh, this did not. Oh, you're wow. Okay. Um, this does not upload your saves to the Steam Cloud. That is unfortunate. Oh well, it, it doesn't matter. We can start with an easy song. But yeah, essentially bullets will come flying at you based on the song that you're playing and you have to avoid them. Observe. Yeah, it's telling you right there. Dodge the music. Oh, this, uh, I might need a actual mouse pad for this. doesn't penalize you that hard for getting hit. The song still continues, so you're fine in that regard. You just get a lower percentage. And if you hold down left click, you can slow down the bullets to help with some precision aiming, or movement rather. The only thing is if you slow things down too long, more bullets can show up on the screen. So you don't want to use that as a major crutch. Got it. And that's the basic flow of the game. So yeah, after a song, 91% you know, I got hit. That was my own fault. And based on how well you do, you can unlock more songs. So I need nice more percentage points to unlock this song. Just need to get something better for my mouse to sit on. And yeah, I know the chat is less active today, but it's also like a music-based stream, and I also like doing a lot of concentration, so it's fine. Uh, what's a, another good song? I'm trying to remember which ones I got like hundreds on, but... 
Like, because this game doesn't upload your saves to the cloud, I'm starting over from scratch. This is a good song I remember. Okay, that was pure luck. on this game. A lot of it is memorization, too, because there are some instances where things are coming a little too fast for, like, anyone to truly react to it. Alright, that was just... That, that was me not paying attention. also do that to get out of a sticky situation just really quickly moving your mouse it causes the tracking to like screw up don't rely on it though Yeah, the song, I mean, the, the game doesn't penalize you that bad at all for screwing up on a song. Like, most other rhythm games will just kick you out of a song if you play too bad. This one allows you to finish because, like I said, everything is percentage-based. And it's cumulative, too. These are secret songs. You unlock them by getting hearts in the game. I don't know if I'll be able to show off some of those in this little go through and there are also like harder versions of songs too and you'll get like a bunch of different music genres in here too you get to hear a little like teaser of what the level has to offer alright let's see this is a good one but and eh, three circles is gonna be pretty hard but screw it i believe this is what i get for looking at chat i'm sorry right. i'll check what you said after this song small i'm sorry i gotta focus oh my god Ah. 
Oh my god, I'm... This is awful. I'm screwing up this song. Oh my god. This, this is, this is just bad. Oh, and then you got those little mines. They chase you down. That means you're always gonna have to be moving whenever they show up. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is... I knew this was gonna be pretty bad, though, because it's been a hot minute since I last played this. I swear I'm better at this game than what it looks like. Okay, he came out of nowhere. Oh, you got Bravely Default instead of Emerald? Uh, yes. Bravely Default is an amazing game. Normally, I would say skipping out on Emerald is a pretty bad decision, but it's Bravely Default. It, it, it is... I love it. It's definitely in my top five 3DS games. It's so good. And Final Fantasy Tactics 2 is a Christmas present. Tactics is good. I mean, Fire Emblem is still my, like, tactical RPG of choice, but... I played uh, the PSP port of Final Fantasy Tactics, and it was good. Yeah, I apologize for my horrendous showing on that song. I mean, I still got a passing grade, but still. And also, this game has what they call a Zen mode. It's where you can play through the song and not have to worry about bullets. Hmm. I'm trying to think of a good one to go to now. I think this is a fun one. If most of the Final Fantasy 15 DLC is canceled, does this mean there won't be a season pass? No, I think the ones that were canceled were outside of the season pass, so you're fine. Oh, oh, you mean like if it must mean a second season pass. Yeah, there won't be. So yeah, you'll probably have to pay for like that last episode by itself. Oh, Emerald was sold out. I mean, you made great decisions though. Like, tactics and Bravely Default. <laughs>
version of that song. Yeah. That's a neat one. Uh, I'm gonna go back to the main menu for a minute and auto gen mode. That means that you can actually like select a song you might have on your computer and play a auto generated map of it. And there's a level editor too. You can make your own sound outer levels. Pretty neat. Uh, but real quick, just gonna head on over here to the DLC. Oh wow, they actually separated by season. That's pretty cool. Huh, so I'm expecting that. Uh, see, what's a good DLC song? I say as I look at this difficulty and it's like, wow. This song frightens me. <laughs> uh, Sorry, right, gun is cool. But let's go with Nuclear Throne. It's gonna be rough, though. So close. The heart. Eh. These essentially give you like an extra hit. And your goal is to crap. Make it to the end of the stage with the heart in tow to unlock more stages. Yeah. It won't matter on the user generate or user created stages. It only matters when you save a heart on one of the main stages. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. See, I'm more used to shmups as opposed to actual bullet hells where all I'm doing is dodging and not shooting. You got it. Oh my god. Maybe I should actually go on like Zen mode for a few of these so you can enjoy the music. <laughs> this is bad. This is how hard the game can get. This is just awful. So yeah, that song wrecked my face. Hey, they're extra challenges for a reason. This is a cool one I remember. Uh, oh, these don't have a Zen mode? Oh, I actually have to go through it once to unlock Zen mode. Fair enough. All right, let's go to Samurai Gun. Why not? This is the opening theme to an indie game, just like Nuclear Throne was. Be safe in the center. Wow.
Jesus the evil of this user generated or the user created stage the black backgrounds uh. yeah that's a rough one but it's a cool song I shouldn't be too hard on myself for doing worse than how I used to do in this game. It has been like years since I last touched it and rhythm games are kind of like a thing where if you haven't played one in a hot, like you need to keep playing them. Otherwise you'll fall out of practice and like the skills you had are just completely gone. Uh, let's see, I haven't seen what the new DLC is. This sounds like it's using Zelda music. And it sounds really good. What are these? I'm sorry, what? Six star? Yeah, nope. I like the sound of this one, too. I'll see what this one's all about, though. It, it sounds cool. It sounds like it's like trying to use the Zelda 2 temple theme. Oh my god, really? That was a nice chill one. I just had no excuse getting hit at the very start like that. That was awful. 
I say as I get a 97%. What else they got? Season three, this is definitely new to me. Okay, I like the sound of this. I didn't know if the music was gonna start up there for a second, okay. I can't get an idea of what this song is going to be like. Yeah, that's going to be a no. Oh my god, what? I think I'm going to stay away from that. Oh my god. You know a song is hard when it goes past like the standard five star difficulty rating. And we got Kevin MacLeod on here. I kind of want to see what this one's going to be like, but the four stars is all putting ass. Yeah, screw it. I'll do it. Why not? I just want to see what else is waiting. Really? Galaxian. It's probably a remix, but still. Okay, they put a lot into season three. Like, a lot. Okay, no, I'm sorry, I gotta do this. Even though it's probably about to destroy my face, five star difficulty and whatnot. Oh, this is so good. Sorry, what are these? I... They have a custom bullet type? And I'm getting hit by nothing? Okay, yeah, I'm just looking at this like, what in the world? How does anybody do this? I don't even know what those circles are. I've never seen them. Oh, I'm safe when I'm inside them. Oh my god. I kind of want to learn this song, but at the same time, this looks utterly ridiculous. <laughs> no, that one didn't save me. Maybe I have to hit all the circles or I get hit. That's a... could be. Like I said, that is something that is not in the main game, so I don't know how to deal with it. Oh my god. <laughs> this, is, this is utterly ridiculous. But as you can see, this game can get difficult. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> 
It's also long. I don't even think slowing down would help me at this point. Okay, yeah, I don't know what the circle does. <laughs> I might have to watch somebody's video on that. that. That's a neat song, but yeah, that is well out of my skill level right now. <laughs> See, where was the other one I said I wanted to take a look at this? Back to my two-star difficulty. Oh my god, and I still got hit. <laughs> oh. Like that previous song kind of just destroyed my reflexes right now. I'm not in the right state of mind. Oh my god. Yeah, this this is uh this is not about to happen. I'm I I'm on full tilt. I, I just need to leave. Oh my god. Ugh. I guess I could show like a little bit of Zen mode now. Like what happens in Zen mode. I mean it, it's pretty self-explanatory, but Still, it would be nice to see it in action. So, yeah, you activate Zen mode like that, go into the song, and then, oh, look, I'm about to hit this bullet. Let's see. Yep. So, this is what a lot of people do to just practice a song. You know, still try to like play normally, but then if they get hit, like, okay, that is a problem bullet. I need to watch out for that later on. So, yeah. You can still slow down, too, in Zen mode. But this is why you don't want to excessively slow down. Because look at all these bullets. Technically, if you really wanted to, you could just, like, slow for the entire song, but where's the fun in that? So, yeah. That's all there is to Zen mode. I don't know why I'm still here. <laughs> but just, just enjoy the nuclear throne opening thing. I'm surprised nobody created things for the rest of the nuclear throne OST, because that has a lot of good music in it. All right, yeah, let's actually get back to playing the game, though. Uh... Yeah, why not? Let, let's let's go back to the main game with an actual like human difficulty curve. Yeah, why not? And I'm probably still gonna screw up on this one star difficulty thing. I know they're circles. I'm calling them stars.
roads and through beaches trying to reach you extending these zones out to feel you and if I could touch you Yay, my first hundred of the stream. And it was on a one star difficulty song. Whatever. We take those. We take those. We unlock. What's Squirrel Quest game? Oh, I think I remember that one. Walking the Park is cool. But real quick, I'm going to take a brief detour over here to options. Show off some of the options. Doi, you have audio settings, visual settings. Visual settings are neat though because you can show the hitbox of your circle. Guess I'll keep it on there for now. Um, visual effects, effects, bullet spin and particles. I thought this had a. I mean, yeah, you have that. I I could have sworn this had a. Uh, What's the word I'm looking for here? Colorblind mode. I guess not. But yeah, with the show hitbox thing, you can see the hitbox of your circle. Um, the, oh yeah, high contrast is good. Like, especially for a game like this. But yeah, I could have sworn there was a colorblind mode. I guess not. I mean... I, to be fair, you probably still could get away with not having that because everything hurts you. So you don't really need to differentiate the colors, but still. Oh well, but yeah, like your hitbox isn't the whole circle itself. It's just one dot in the middle of the circle. So you're about to see that now as we take a walk in the park. See? So you got a little leeway if you even touch a bullet. Should have slowed down. Wow. <laughs> uh, 
try to get sneaky with that one. Oh my god. I used to remember the pattern for this one, like, really well. Uh. Yeah, it could have gone better. Could have gone better. Oh well. by Reunited Trilogy not having subtitles and that sorry excuse Activision gave. But it's just Activision being Activision. What can you expect from them at this point? transcribe the script yeah I mean it's not like this oh my god I I can't talk and play this at the same time screw it but it's, it's not like it's going to take forever to transcribe the scripts of the Spyro games it's Spyro not a freaking like four disc JRPG like Odyssey it's just Spyro they could hire somebody on like Twitter or something to do it and they'd be done in like a couple hours. Oh my god. Especially in Spyro 1 because there's just so many dragons that you save that all they say is thank you for releasing me and then that's it so i mean come on now and again i have yet to even open my copy of reignited really so i don't even know if they changed what they say wouldn't be shocked if they did Some of these have like, like when you know what you're dealing with, some of these are just easy. Like all I'm doing right here is just moving in a circle. And that was good. Wow. That was good for like a large portion of that song. Hey, yeah, but come on. It, it's not like it would take them forever and a day to add subtitles for those spiral games. They, they can do it. fit in one more song. Screw it, let's let's have my face handed to me on uh one of these user levels. Where was that one that was like eight stars or something? I think it was in season three. Let's end with a bang. Look at this shit. This pale color palette is screwing with my brain. Wow. What are these circles? I 
probably gonna have to watch like a video of somebody going through these levels because I do not know what these circles are. Yeah, I mean, I still get hit. I, I don't know. I mean, this doesn't have, what, seven stars for a reason? Or this has seven stars for a reason. Yeah. I know how to English. But I don't know how to play. Wow. <laughs> this is awful. But hey, at least we're gonna get Zen mode for this. I'm sure this is a really good song. You know, we, we're only hearing it in like five second bursts. Wow. Seemed like it worked on that last little barrage there. I guess. the last one you activate that keeps you safe. I don't even know anymore. I've kind of stopped trying on this song. Oh my god. Yeah, I am curious if somebody did this without taking any damage. remember seeing like one video of like somebody made a level but then he couldn't even beat it and he just deemed it impossible so he had to show it off and like oh, crap zen mode be fair though it is pretty easy to make unbeatable songs in this game them before they hit the end of the thing so they don't actually keep you safe you just have to activate and if you don't activate them you take damage let me see yeah okay all right all right that makes sense that makes sense so they they're not actually shields they a lot of them just happen to be moving along paths where bullets wouldn't hit you for the most part. Whew. So yeah, that's Sound Dodger. It is, it can get rough. It can get rough. Yeah, I know I had a 79, I had a 59%, but it wasn't quite nice. It wasn't quite nice. But hey, yeah, that's Sound Dodger. I swear I am pretty decent at this game. It's just been a while, but still had fun. You know. So yeah, if you've never played a bullet hell or like really high intensity shoot 'em up, that's what you kind of have to look forward to there. So um, yeah, another little break, and we'll be back with Rhythm Ten Rhythm Ten Goku. That's the name. I think it is. That game, next.
Okay, and we are back. I just need to go ahead and take down this. There we go. We're good. So this is Rhythm Ten Goku. It is the first game in Nintendo's Rhythm Heaven series. I, I don't think that's the real name of the series. I, I, I don't know anymore, but yeah, this was before Rhythm Heaven and all that jazz. It was just never released here in the States. So yeah, Rhythm Heaven was originally on the Game Boy Advance. It was never localized. That's why the Rhythm Heaven game for Switch is like so major because it uses a lot of games from this game that you know, we never saw over here in the States. I am very good at my words, but yeah, whatever, let's play. So, yeah, uh, the good folks at, like, well, just good ROM hacking folk in general, they released an English patch for this game, so even Americans can enjoy it. Everyone has rhythm. No, no they don't. But they like to pretend they do. If you are conscious of your rhythm sense, it will steadily improve. First, let's take a quick look at your current rhythm sense. Let's find out how good your rhythm is. We will be doing three tests. Our machine prints slowly. So use sound to guide you. Just press the A button in time with the sound. Okay, wait. You failed the first test. Okay, this is this is awful, and I I apologize, everybody. Okay, I was a little all over the place there. I kind of lost the rhythm. Move on to the second test. Press A when the timer hits zero. When there's no sound, count to yourself to keep the beat. Was kind of rough okay I was getting progressively early and early on that I started off fine let's test press any time of the sound again Okay, I can do this. I am ready. I'm 
wondering if there's some latency in my controller. And oh, here I go, blaming the controller. Eh. Two point three points. Y'all just gonna put me on blast like that? I mean, I know I can do better, but still. How was it? It's not important how well you did on the tests. As long as you have fun, that's the main thing. No, I'm not using a wireless controller though, I'm wired in. Your latent rhythm sense will grow with practice. We've got quite a few games in store for you. Enjoy. All right. Let's see what these games are all about. Oh, really, Karate Man? All right. Karate training at its most intense, or at its most unorthodox. Welcome. This is the Karate Man game. In this game, all you have to do is punch stuff by pressing the A button. Easy. Well, the timing is very precise. Want to try it? First, let's try squarely punching some stuff. Oh, wow. You have to be precise. How'd you do? Do you understand the precise timing? Next, let's try jabbing the music. Okay, wait. get it. How is it? Isn't it easier with music to guide you? Let's follow the music and give whatever flies at you a nice square punch. Running might help too. I will save you all that. Don't forget to get into it. This song is amazing. <laughs> oh, I have to avoid the bomb? Aw. Wisdom from the master. For now, that'll do. Okay. That song was amazing, though. <laughs> So yeah, I did merely okay on that. It's fine, it's fine. Vegeta pool, or I, I, I guess the actual pun there is Vegeta pool. I see what they did there. Hey Vegeta, there's weird hairs. Keep growing. Pluck them. Pluck them. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> what's going on behind me? Rhythm heaven. All right, pluck the hairs with A for the D-pad. Okay, I get this. The curly hairs take a while. Hold down the button. Okay. 
Okay. Overwhelmed. <laughs> Try alternating A and the D pad. Okay. Here's the real thing. You're kind of listening in silence, so you don't know what the hell's going on. same time. That's why I don't talk and play at the same time. Alright, that was decent enough. Useless hairs check. The long hairs are neatly cut, but still just okay. Screw you, that was perfect. Why do our vegetables grow hair? That is a good question. So yeah, if you're wondering why this game is like utterly insane, it's because it's done by the same dev team as WarioWare. Marcher, time to march, but I wish the commander wouldn't speak in Japanese. <laughs> But this game was in Jeff. Oh, okay. Mark time, March. This one being tough. I know he's getting mad at me, but... Alright, that, that one was just all bad. Oh, 
does this game end? I wouldn't be shocked if it is punishing me, but... Still, something like this would have an out. Too early. I saw that video. It was a cool video. Oh crap. was all practice. Oh, this is going to be tough. I think that was extended just so you could so you could understand what he's trying to say. popular belief. <sighs> yeah, we got left behind. That's that's a shame. My flow is not so good, and I need to pass that to... Ooh. Alright, alright. I need to actually pay attention. Like... Alright, let me see. Sorry. I kind of understand it. a little bit better. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Today's duty is cleaning. All right, all right. Had to learn a little bit of Japanese for that one, but it was fine. It's fine. See, we're, we're back on the positive flow. Don't worry about the zoom. Follow the trajectories in your heart. Spaceball. Oh, this looks like something I would draw.
This is amazing. Oh no, I hit a donut. You can do it even when you can't see, but still just okay? I'm sorry, what? Practice is the key to reaching new heights. Trio, the world famous copy trio never misses a beat. Watch the other two. I'm so mad. We're the clappy trio. Nobody claps like us. You do the third clap, okay? <laughs> it's that freaking fatal frame, but okay in rhythm heaven. <laughs> wow, that okay. I don't even have a comeback to that. Wait, who roasted you like that? Small. Showtime, oh no. It's almost like I never played DJ Hero and Guitar Hero back in the day. Need to focus on the basics. The trio just went so low. How? That doesn't make sense. Alrighty. Let's try again, shall we? See you later, Sapphire. Okay, I just need to do better. I just need to do better. That was on beat and they know it. Oh, come on.
god. This is surprisingly tough. Wow. Um yikes. Like I don't know what the trick is for this cuz I'm trying to watch the first one to get a like feel for the rhythm, but then when they change the tempo up on me, that takes me by surprise. I'm gonna try something here. Or not. I can't. Okay. Never mind. I was gonna try and switch the keyboard for that, but screw it. I can probably make this work. I just need to focus. Like Parappa, I gotta believe! This is surprisingly tough. And I should not be having this much trouble with it. Apparently I did slightly better that time. Oh my god. I will do this. At least the song doesn't change, so that's good. That went considerably better. What? Your syncopation sounded great. Also, you showed a great sense of flow, but still just okay. I'll take it, because that one was kind of rough. Please show up for more of our practice sessions. I'll take it. I will take it. All right, the first remix. Ew. It's gonna be kind of rough. It's gonna be kind of rough. Your skill so far speaks for itself, you know? I can do this. Oh no. Ooh. 
That was rough. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> hey, I'll take it. The performance was like a breakfast. The most important part of your day? I don't get that. They said my performance was like a breakfast. Okay, take it. <laughs> okay then. Whatever. Hey, C's get degrees. And now we got more of the game opened up. Bonus. Collect medals to play with more. Cafe, how's your mood been lately? Come here for a consultation. Collect medals to play with more toys. Everyone likes toys. Earn medals to unlock special games. See how far you can get. Drum lessons. Our game comes with free drum lessons. You pay good money for them, so why not? All right, well, yeah, let's check out my mood. Why not? This is your first time here, isn't it? This is the cafe. You can't finish a game, or when you just want a break, please come here and relax. I'm pretty good at rhythm games. If you need help, come to the cafe. I'm still unpacking boxes, so please come back in a bit. See you later. So I guess that's, like, tips and stuff. All right, what do we got here? Sneaky spirits. Ghosts are trying to escape their haunted house. Grab your trusty ball. <laughs> For ghosts. What? When you get a hang of things, this is pretty easy. Yeah. 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 Oh. Oh, that was it. Okay. Spiritual commentary. You hit even when they were quiet. Also, your internal count was spot on. Also, you did superbly against the slow ones. But still just okay. God. So what, if you're anything less than perfect, you're merely okay? Are they really re up up the raises for the last three minutes? <laughs> yeah. Alright then. Uh, that was that was a tough one. Run. Uh, samurai slice. Run. They're coming. They're samurai. So you can't stay behind and stop. Slice the enemies. This fog. Got him. Hmm. 
two of them? a little poorly though, but you know. Ah. Okay, they came a little too slow there. Tells people things. A true samurai can fight in darkness. Ah. Not good enough. Did he break his sword on a flower? What kind of samurai are you? All right, let's go. Slice the enemy. Yeah, we read this already. I mean, that's kind of how you play a rhythm game. You gotta just keep the beat going. You gotta keep the groove up. I got one of them. You could strike even in deep fog. Also, your sword moves so quickly. But still just okay. I like how the game just like greatly compliments you and is like, eh, is I. You you're okay. Must concentrate more. Cheese heist. I got a family. <laughs> now, one last job and I'm out of this business for good. Stick to the plan. Hold A to stop. Watch the signal. At the second signal, let go of A to run. We can't be seen. Use those plates. Oh, okay. Oh, you can't stop too early. All right. Okay, I see how this goes. I like this. No more signals. Trust your gut. And stay cool. Alright, so you gotta pay attention to the cat paws.
Okay, kind of rough there up on the end, but that was a fun one. It was nice. Rap sheet. You barely made it. Really. I love you and this cheese. Yeah, this game requires a lot of precision to get above an okay. God. Memo from assistant. We have quite a germ outbreak on our hands. Help us. Dr. Bacteria. <laughs> Too real. Alright, everybody, we're stopping the E. coli outbreak. trip core. Ugh, scientific findings. You let a lot go. Try again. Alright, alright. <laughs> They'll cut my funding. Alright, alright. I just need to like remember my bit trip core skills and I'll be fine. gonna stop the Eli the, the E. coli breakout in the romaine lettuce and the salmonella outbreak in the turkey we're gonna do this we're gonna save Thanksgiving Okay, I don't think I let any pass. It was a brilliant extermination. <gasps> I got a superb. I got a superb. <gasps> this medicine will save lives. We did it, guys. We saved Thanksgiving. You can eat turkey and romaine lettuce. No, don't, don't do it in IRL, though. You, you, you kind of need to... Actually, the CDC added more stuff that you're supposed to avoid, too. Like, I, I think peanut butter crunch is also, like, something you're not supposed to eat as well. Uh, ground turkey. Oh my god, it's more stuff. Because somebody posted it in Pep Pep's certain route today. Ground beef, too? Jesus Christ. Anyway, the Bonadori. It's the traditional Bond Festival. Clap your hands and sing along. Oh no, I gotta clap again. See, I, I just saved Thanksgiving and now I gotta clap? Ugh. Let's do the Bonadori dance. Clap whenever you hear a pan. That was a pan. Okay, I like this. Okay. 
okay. When you hear Pampa clap twice. adorable as hell. Okay, I get it. Enough practice. Please don't get rid of the words. find the mp3 of this. I desperately need the mp3 of this. I'm just in awe. I know that was awful. First half was so-so. Again, the second half was dreadful. <laughs> they just left around like that? That's what happens when you mess up a festival? They just leave you out in the rain? It's cold-blooded, man. We're gonna do this, though. I am so downloading this song after this stream. Yeah, I know, <laughs> they're giving me a bad look. This is just bad. I had the rhythm for a minute. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is about to be a bad one. And that last one screws me up too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was bad. <laughs> It reminds me of that, uh, was it Dribble and Spits, their level in Wario where Smooth Moves? I think that's where Tomorrow Hill played, the Dribble and Spits stage. But yeah, like, it's just an amazing song where you screw up a micro game, the lyrics change, and the song just sounds all distorted. It's kind of reminding me of that. Anyway, uh, let's end on... Oh wait, he's gonna give me a tip, I guess. Getting tired? Don't forget to rest now and then. Oh no. Was this the start of Nintendo telling you to take a rest every 15 minutes? Still the Bonadori? Are you having trouble? Do you like I could let you skip that game? Oh. Well, that's nice of you, but no. You're determined to beat it with your own strength? Excellent. First Wario? No, I, I, like, Tomorrow Hill is one of my favorite songs. Like, I, I know for a fact that plays in um, Smooth Moves, but I don't remember. I'm thinking it was the Dribble and Spit stage, because I know it's like you're running, but was their car broken down? I don't know, but it, no, in the first Wario where, though, um, on the Dribble and Spit stage in the first Warrior, where the song it plays is, I, I think it's translated to like sailing away or something like, uh, uh, yeah, something similar to that. Cause it plays on the radio and then there's like remixes of it too, depending on like what stage of the micro games you're on, like what tempo you're on. But yeah, I know way too much about Warrior, where, or at least I've played too much. But, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Like, there was a Dribble and Spit stage in the first one, but the song I'm thinking of was in Smooth Moves. Oh, I thought you were going to actually give me a tip for that stage. No, you're just like, yeah, I can let you skip it if you want, because you kind of suck. Wait, what toys do I have? I only unlocked one because I'm horrible at this game. Let's see what Meow Mixer is. Okay. Well, I thought it would keep playing, but... I have no clue what I'm doing here. I'm just playing around. So you just need better rhythm than me. Got it. Yeah, this is not working out. I mean, it's just something to fool around with, but... Still, I was just not doing well. Well, at least I unlocked Mr. Upbeat. Nice to meet you. So it's just an endless game. Press A to hop over the needle. I can do it. <laughs> Let's try that again. Okay. Oh my god. Okay.
So all of that only counted for one point? That's kind of rough. Alright, then drum lessons. Oh, I need more medals for that. Okay. Let's end on karate, I guess. You know, let's, let's try it one more time. I just like the song that played on this. Don't forget to get into it. Oh my god. Part of that was me just trying not to break out laughing because of the song. Anyway, uh, that's gonna be it for the stream. We're not gonna quite break for lunch. We're breaking for the night. So, thank you all for tuning in to this stream where I played rhythm games of varying skill. And uh, yeah, hope you all enjoyed it. See you all next time. Don't know what's coming up next. Though. But, uh, I'll keep you all posted. So, yep, thank you all for tuning in and good night. <laughs>